Mm. Oh, dang. Hold on. It has certainly proven valuable. Saved me. A few times, without question. For now, though, it would seem you and I have found purpose uh -oh. in Constellation. I believe that is enough. I am pleased that we have common cause and have enjoyed our time together. Thank you. Interesting. So, are Sarah and Adoring Fan on my ship right now? Because somebody just told me that when their ship disappeared in their playthrough, when it came back, the crew that were on it disappeared from their game. I wonder, I wonder if they're gone. Because if so, like, that may mean that Sarah's, like, gone from our game. Um, we'll have to go check that. We'll have to go check that. That's kind of a huge deal. That means we might have left the... We might have missed Adoring Fan and Sarah. They just may be gone. We can check that, though. Lives of nearly every individual in the separate systems are so heavily. NG plus plus, let's go. I know, right? Well, you're only as safe as your equipment out there. Welcome to our all of our product. And while I've, as I've said, I would, and of course, yes, by all means. Have... Dang it! Wow, this guy is like rare stuff. buying all your rare things thank you um modified arc welder no good helmets no good packs got some better spacesuits than we have but okay. get some of this money back I don't think our girl is carrying any weapons or anything, is she? See you around. Let's do this real quick. I would never dream of selling. Uh, please do. I hope. Is there anything on our ship we can sell? Not really. get all this stuff is did we get all this when we got like the supplies from the uc thing because that's kind of cool if so to be honest i think i think that's where we got all that oh my god why do we have all this That just probably freed up a ton of stuff. Okay. Good luck on all your adventures. Thanks. That's all the decorations on your ship? Nanny. No. Did I just sell all the decorations on my... No. No. I don't think so. Don't get me wrong, that'd be amazing if that actually was the case, but I don't think that's the case. Oh, 
on the plus side, we now have a super clean ship. It, it's true. Yeah. Oh, when you delete parts from your ship, it moves the decorations to your stash. So those are probably like when I deleted the original halves and put in new halves. Interesting. All right, if Annoying Fan and Sarah are there, we're okay. But if they're not, we're kind of screwed. I feel like losing Sarah could have some serious ramifications for our game because we needed to talk to her for main quest stuff. There's Vasco. He's been part of our crew. I'm listening. Oh, okay, Sarah's here. What about Adoring Fan? Yo, we absolutely lost the Doring fan. He is gone. Oh, man. He is gone. Well, that sucks. How terrible. Oh, no. That's horrible. Whatever will we do? Not wish to lighten your load. Lighten your load. One is less likely to survive an ambush when one is weighed down with whatever all that is. Rude. Okay. Hmm. Check my assign assignments menu. It says that he is on our ship. Yeah, it's, it totally says that he's on our ship. So what we essentially have to do is when we reap, we have to save up another 200K, it looks like. And then when we rebuild our ship for the, the final time, we'll have to use the frontier and that way this bug won't happen anymore. Can I assign him somewhere else? I don't really have anywhere else to assign him. I could, well, I can maybe put him on the... Maybe I can assign him to another ship? I see, I only have pirate ship. So I don't, I, maybe I could like, let's try this real quick, just to check. Oh, unassigned with R. Okay. Let's just see if this works real fast. Kind of curious at this point. should inspect your ship for heat leeches every couple. Okay, no problem. Home ship. Oh! There you are. I've been counting the seconds until your return. So wait, is he... Okay, so now he and okay, so he's on the ship now. I didn't think numbers could go that high. People say I that was a oh, That's cool. I mean we can get him back. Be hard to talk. So is he gonna be on the ship now? If he's on the ship, then I mean we're basically set. Yeah, there he is. Okay, cool, so that's not a big deal. Great. Great! <clears throat> You have any idea what class you're gonna play for your Baldur's Gate 3 Dark Urge run? Uh, no idea. No, not right now. Kind of looking at like maybe Shadow Monk or something, but maybe a caster? I have no clue. It's gonna be a while until we do it, so we got lots of time. Lots of time. Dealing in art is a. If it belongs on your ship, then I'm sure we have it for sale. There is a bit more in the back. If oh, please take a. Hey, I don't think I have anything to sell now, right? Now we are. 
hurting for monies. Thanks for shopping at Emerson Mercantile. Hey, I don't know if you've heard this before, but you look like Peter Dinklage dashing. Why, thank you. Peter Dinklage is a handsome man. I appreciate that. I got contacts on him. Bigger time. Oh, you don't have any here. Interesting. Okay. Watch your back out there. Have you messed with a transfer container at your main outpost? I don't even I don't even know if I have a transfer container at my main outpost. Until you can like decide limits of items that can go in something like a transfer container, my outpost like can't even use it, man. So like it would instantly get flooded with random low tier materials if I were to plug it into my main network. What I think they really need to do is they need to make it. Yay! Off he goes! Okay. What they really need to do is they need to make it so um, when you go, like you need to be able to either build something or you need to be able to access every container in your outpost in one interface. So what would be amazing for instance is if you were to build the transfer thing, and instead of it just showing what's in it, it would it would give you access to every everything in all the outpost things in one master list. Like that would be incredibly cool. Because then you could like sort out and cap things. You could you know take out stuff and and put, just throw it on the ground so you have room for other things. And oh man, that'd be so nice. Everyone up here. Is there anything up here? There's, there's nothing up here. An entire floor and an elevator built to come up here to nothing. Okay. Cool. Mm. Can you throw me on the ground? Yes. But please don't, because it hurts. I told you I was going back for that master thing. Told you, chat. I tried to warn you. I tried to warn you, chat. You didn't listen. You didn't listen! Alright, I think it was in here. Boom. Okay, we're doing this. Watch there be something amazing in here. That would be nice. Fifteen hundred credits ain't bad. That's worth the trip. We can just fast travel out. That's fine. Uh, we're going to Mast. I think actually, I'm pretty sure residential is closest to Mast. Let's see. Oh wait, where does it want me to go? Yeah, it wants me to go here. Oh, actually, yeah, mass is probably mass. Is closer. What's the point of the base building? Uh, mostly to mostly to not only funnel resources, but also to um, well, it's mostly to funnel resources. It also gives you a place to like store your stuff and build everything that you need to to use like benches and such if you don't want to put it all on your ship, stuff like that. 
The game's not even technically out and people are already anticipating mods. Oh, dude, people were anticipating mods for this game before it was even announced. <laughs> Just how it works, man. That's Bethesda. Okay, let's see. Muzzle mods. Zero wire. Polymer. Boom. Magazine and battery. Titanium. Lead. Adhesive. We, see, we farm all of these things we have farming at our outpost. You could, of course, just bought it, but, you know, this is cooler. We have no iridium. Interesting. Boom. Okay. This all needs uh, weapon engineering three. Boom. Power generation two. So power generation three. Damn, look at all that stuff. Woo! I do not have, like, almost any of this. That's wild. Yeah, we need, we need all of these. That's crazy. That looks badass, though. Look at that thing. Finish the aluminum, finish the titanium. And now we need more neon. Mark that. Okay. We can put on an extended barrel or a long barrel. Increase accuracy, recoil, and range. Or vastly increase accuracy, recoil, and range. Uh, let's go with the... this one. Boom. The laser. We need more neon. We gotta find a way to get neon, chat. Mark Neon and start picking that up. Double barrel muzzle. Changes rounds fired to go through a two barrel att attachment for different spread shots. Muzzle mod three. Focal lens. Fast increases accuracy. Or focus nozzle. Increases damage, headshot damage, and range. Yes. Okay. Ergonomic stock. Increase aiming down the sight. Okay, perfect. And we are upgrading the hell out of this gun. Annihilator rounds. Banned by almost every government, these rounds produce a disease-like effect that spreads to any target that gets too close. Okay. Um. Amplifies power put increasing damage. I need more iso-centered magnets. Now, for the iso-centered magnets, though, or whatever that's called, I think... I don't know if we can build those. Oh, I can. So wait, we can actually get that on the gun? Oh, my God. Oh, I need internal mods too. Oh, bummer. Which, which needs uh, gun rank three. Wait, internal mods two. What, wait, what do I need for that? Wait, maybe I can get that. Oh, weird. No, that does require gun engineering three. Okay. There's neon in the nation system on Crete. Cool. I'll check that out later. Thank you. I think I only have like one or two outposts left that I can do. Um, we'll see. What's that cat? Cool. 
boop, 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 doop. All right. Everything is trucking here. Need zero wire for the gun. I, th I think we were good anyway. So back to what we were doing. We're going to go to here. Then to... Nest. My ship looks hella cool. Well, I appreciate it. It is very hella not done. Yeah, I've got big plans for this ship. But unfortunately, I need a ton more money that I don't have. Yep. Yeah, with the waypoint here, why this is Mass District, so why isn't it telling me to travel to Mass District? That's very weird. It's very strange. It seems like just a big old bug. Hydration is required. What upcoming games would not make me buy this Wait, game? Captain, Sergeant, you mean was looking for you. Weird question. Sounds like he's got more Don't really have an answer to it. I mean, there's other good games coming out, but, you know. Captain... You're back sooner than... Oh, oh, wait. Did... Did you actually succeed? With Radcliffe? And Balmore? We're all in agreement. Oh, by the way, I can announce this now. Uh, we're doing a sponsored stream this afternoon of a game that I... I don't know if I would have played solo, but they wanted me to play it with Dan's Gaming, so I said sure. So me and Dan are going to play uh, Trine 5 this afternoon, um, which should be interesting, as I don't, I don't think I've ever played a Trine game. So yeah, we're gonna have we're gonna do some uh, some trying five shenanigans this afternoon. <laughs> the desire to stand fades. Oh, thank you, girl. <clears throat> uh, what time? Uh, two thirty. Mm. Oh, one sec. No more. Yeah, game looks cool. I mean, I, are you just trying it out then? Nice. <clears throat> Very nice. Yeah, no, they, they pinged me on it, and uh, I took a look at it. I mean, it looks, looks interesting. Right. Looks like it could be fun. Maybe a fun with friends situation. My camera too high? My camera got bumped or something. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, code pieces from House Rune and the Free Star Collected ready to be deployed. Oh, that's why. There we go. Okay. So the old man was still lurking around in there. Fine work, Captain. And now I've already arranged everything with the archival monitors. When you get down there, the UC monitor will give you instructions on how to deploy the codes. Follow them to the letter. Here, the UC code piece and an archival access card. The entrance is just on the other side of the plaza across from Mast. Absolute best behavior down there. All right. Okay. Baron Von Blast, 11 months So I've been following on and off for so many years. Thanks for your insights, fair reviews, and humor all these years. Congrats on 10 years of partnership. Code Hi. Jam from Baron. Thank you, Baron. Appreciate you, dude. Thank you for your support.
record? What response? I'm told by top officials the cabinet already has a plan in place to open the Armistice Archives. Unless that archive's full of ordnance, it's not enough. I see. Well, thank you for taking the time. Hey, publish what I said, all right? Something needs to be done. Oh, I'm as concerned as you are. Thank you again for speaking with me. Mm, one second. Hey. Okay. Not speaking with her. Nope. Ponytail guy has bad posture. I don't have a ponytail. What are my thoughts on the game so far? Todd out of 10 would again. station oh over here maybe the giant blue hexagon Welcome, okay to to proceed, you will need to deposit your code into the three corresponding receptacles once they are verified i will open the door your data resides in unit 18 you will not be able to access any of the other units once you've collected your data return to the entrance you may insert the first of the archival codes when you're ready to begin. Okay. Under T for Terramorph. Oh, MJ Sharky, this is how I roll, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, this is this is pretty normal. If it's not your thing, then the pro the stream is probably not for you. <laughs> fought a Terramorph yet? Yes, we fought a couple. Mm -hmm. I'm here for the cat cam. That's fair. Hey, Scribbles. How you doing this morning? Wait, where are you taking me? Oh, we're going back to the uh, lady up top. Okay. Did I read it? No. I wonder if we can read it. Oh, let's do this. So, oh, it's got like numbers and pads on. Damn, dude, got two of them. You know what's important? Where's the cat? Uh, I don't know where Dimitri is. Probably laying in the sun. He loves to do that. This game worth it? Sure is for me. This game looks boring. Walking and talking all the way. There's a lot of walking and talking in this game. If that's not for you, this game is not Seriously? for you. Ooh. Miss Minsky, thank you for the 57 months, bud. Appreciate it. There you are. Captain? Deputy told me what went down. Impressive work. Captain, if you'd be willing to transfer the documents to the Major, she and I have been discussing what comes next. Okay. Time for us to start getting some real answers. 
and figure out if we've been asking the right questions. So whenever you're ready. Is the answer to stopping more attacks really in here? You're carrying the most comprehensive collection of information on Terramorphs in the known universe. If we can't pry an answer out of there, it likely doesn't exist. Certainly doesn't mean it's going to be easy, but we're not going to know until Percival and I dig in, so whenever you're ready. I made someone a promise, Adrian. Can you assure me this data will be used for good? I... Yes. It will be. Percival and I have done our damage. This... This is us starting to put some things right. So with the data out of the way, we've been discussing where exactly this work's getting done. The Red Devil's headquarters on Mars, back where you found Percival, seemed the natural spot. Already has the equipment, the safety measures. Dude. Though it sounded like the deputy had a few more things she Dude. needed to discuss with you first. Dude. Indeed. The most important of which is getting you your citizenship. Then Dude. I guess we'll see you on Mars. Captain? What if the me. people releasing these Terramorphs all did it specifically to get this data out of the archive. Like that was the goal all along. 